Okay, we have opened this advisory circular, this document, and what we're going to do is do a full check to see if it's compliant. I actually have it on my toolbar over here, but if you do not have it, you can go to tools, scroll down till you get to protect and standardize, and it's right there. You just open it or you can save it onto your right hand toolbar. You can see that it's open right across here. We're going to do a full check. Start checking. And we look at that and we go, oh my word, what a mess that we're going to have. So another way to fix this, instead of going through and correcting every one of these different items, because that's just a lot right there is to close this accessibility toolbar, go to your tools, scroll down to your customized, find your action wizard, and go ahead and open it. And you can see my action wizard is across here. So the action that I'm going to do is I'm going to make it accessible. So click that. Here's the file that I'm working on. And we go ahead and press start. The first thing that pops up is the description. I have not fixed that one. So we are going to have to correct this. We're unchecking leave as is. We're going to name this. The title is uh, AC 2173. The subject is installation of an electronic flight bag components. And the author is actually just going to be Air 150. We're not putting any keywords in there, so we'll click OK. We do want English. We want it to be searchable when it's finished and 600 DPI. So now it's converting the scan pages to searchable image. <coughs> this is 11 pages long, so sometimes it just takes a little time to go through the different pages and converting them but it's much easier than us doing it individually over on with accessibility checker. Is this document intended to be used for a fillable form? If so, choose yes. And no, it's not. So we're skipping that step. Our language is English. Now it's got three images that we does not have alternate text. So the first image is the U.S. Department. Mm -hmm. This is the U.S. Department of Transportation seal. It is not a logo. It's a seal. For this alternate text, I've already written all this out. So I'm just going to copy it and paste it in here. So now I've got all the text describing what this figure is. And then the last one is Susan's signature. And then we save and close. Now it's going to check again. And look, we went from all of those to just now we have a heading issue and we have to check the logical reading order and the color contrast. Much easier than it would be if we did it step by step. So we might as well go ahead and check this heading, show in tax panel. Okay, so this is heading one and the next heading is heading four. This really should not be heading four, it should be heading two. And then it makes you wonder if any of the rest of these are. Uh, 
uh, their list. So we're going to leave it alone. We don't want to mess it up too bad. Check again. That's all fine. Logical reading order. We're going to open that up. And we can see the figures first, advisory circle. And you can just go step by step with your down arrow key and see which ones are highlighted to make sure it's going in the order that you normally read things. And this one is not having any kind of problems whatsoever, which is kind of nice. Um, back to accessibility checker that worked so it passed now we need to look at the color contrast what we're going to do is look and see if any of the colors anything on here has got colors that says it's a specific thing to do or anything like that and none of that is so we say it passed and so now it's all good and it has checked out. <laughs>